Even if you're not directly into bodybuilding, you've probably seen these photos before. The insane genetic makeup of people of African descent makes bodybuilding a piece of cake for black people. Here are 10 black bodybuilders with extremely rare genetics who look like gods. Number 10, Simeon Panda. Good people, Simeon Panda here. Simeon Panda has been training for more than 19 years and he's a prime example of how hard work and consistency can make anyone look like a god. Especially if you're black. So what exactly does he do to get this ribbed? Well, pretty much every workout routine on the planet. When it comes to diet, you'll be surprised to know that Panda eats five times a day. He eats every type of rice, mackerel, salmon, and never forgets his veggies. He also makes money from his online programs. Strength training. Ba, 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 ba. There we go. See what I'm saying? Panda certainly knows how to look good while making money. Next up on our list is Sydney Gillan. Sydney Gillan is a professional bodybuilder and a five-time winner of Figa Olympia. She's probably the most hard-working bodybuilder on our list. When it gets a little too easy, I don't like that, so I intentionally put something in to make it harder. But before her debut into bodybuilding, she was a track and field athlete. She also was a contestant on the CBS show Survivor. At her age, Sydney has indeed accomplished a lot. Sydney comes from a bodybuilding background, so bodybuilding for her just comes naturally. We can't argue with that, judging from her confidence and positive vibes. Number 8. Samuel Kubila no trainers and never knows exactly how much his training equipment weigh, this is the lifestyle of Samuel Kubila. Unlike other bodybuilders on our list who have access to fancy equipment, Samuel used to live far from the city and even if he were to live in the city, he couldn't afford any of those fancy equipment. These are the equipment he uses to get this ripped. Leave a like if you're impressed by his ingenuity. Uh, this is where all the hard work is being done and I encourage everybody to come and have a section here. If you uh, by chance come to Ghana, you can come here and train with us. Number 7. Raki Giovanni I don't know about you, but Raki Giovanni is the first female bodybuilder. I've seen back up this match and actually look spectacular with it. Raki Giovanni is a well-known social media star who is becoming increasingly popular for her curvy and thick muscular body. Look at those legs. Raki's workouts are based around functional training patterns like box jumps and sprints. While Raki's workouts are mostly explosive and heat based, she also knows the importance of taking the time to work her body using higher repetitions and lighter weight for size and growth. Number 6 Ulysses Jr. Known for his shredded 8 packs, Ulysses Jr. succeeded in achieving one of the greatest physiques in the world. He defied what many believed a natural bodybuilder was capable of. After years of hard work, Ulysses began giving back to the community by becoming a coach. <laughs> Now, there are many who think his insane physique couldn't be attainable without steroids. To that he says, Um, you know, so if I was juicing for these past 15 years or so, something would have came up, something would have creeped out of the closet. Well, I'm around 200 pounds, that's about 90 kg, and if I've been juicing for nearly 20 years, I need my money back. Number 5. Maggie Marvelous. I started in bodybuilding in 2013. I became a pro in 2014. And in 2015, I won my first bodybuilding. Maggie Marvelous is a two time IFBB champion, and she certainly knows how to lift weights and look good at the same time. Most bodybuilders tend to have an outside source of inspiration that keeps them going. For Maggie, it is the military. At the age of 17, Maggie entered the Marine Corps like her father before her. During her time in the Marines, she reached the rank of a sergeant. She remained in the Marines until 2007 when she became a full-time bodybuilder. Number 4. Arms Collier Having competed in bodybuilding and weightlifting before, he's a well-known weightlifting guard. Arms is also a talented painter and a rapper who has tried his hands on a lot of sports including rugby and American football. Arms regularly mixes workout posts with funny skits online, a blend which he says is behind his rise in popularity. 
Andrea Shaw in the game of bodybuilding. Packing on muscles as much as possible is the game and Andrea is definitely playing it. I mean look at those muscles. Andrea started bodybuilding at an early age. Now at 38 she has won the prestigious Miss Olympia title twice and Miss Rising Phoenix titles as well. Number 2 Ronnie Coleman There is no denying Ronnie Coleman is one of the biggest bodybuilders of our time. He's the winner of the Mr. Olympia title for 8 consecutive years. He's widely regarded as the greatest, if not one of the two greatest bodybuilders of our time. He is also renowned for his combination of size and LBM, dominant body parts and extremely heavy workouts, making him the strongest bodybuilder and Mr. Olympia of all time. Ooh, you gotta get this right. This is heavy weight. Oh, uh. Number 1. Shanique Grant Now, not every bodybuilder has to be extremely bulky. In the world of Shanique, bodybuilding is taking advantage of your already existing physique and turning it into something spectacular. Due to her natural athleticism, it was not long before Shanique Grant developed a type of physique that was worthy of taking to the stage. Now, which of these bodybuilders do you admire? Let us know in the comment section below to share with a friend on Facebook, WhatsApp, and Twitter. As usual, I'm your host Murphy, and I'll catch you in the next video. Stay safe. Peace.